It's a regular routine for mailman Lou Nadeau. Every morning, this Aylmer resident gathers up his bundles of bills, letters, and magazines and prepares to start his 11-mile route. And just like every other day, Lou flicks on his Walkman. Now, that's not unusual. It's not unusual to be loved by anyone. It's not unusual to have fun with anyone. But when I see you hanging about with anyone, No, Luna Doe is not your usual mailman. I mean, how many other mailmen are there who impersonate Tom Jones? Ladies and gentlemen, right now, it's showtime. How about putting your hands together for Tom Jones? Here he is. Thank you very much. Love is like candy on a shelf. But why would anyone want to impersonate Tom Jones? Why Tom Jones? First of all, because uh, apparently I look like him to some people uh, who obviously have sight problems. I don't see it myself. I don't know. All right, come on. But a lot of people in the audience see it, especially the women. Women really genuinely like the kind of uh, magnetism or the the, uh, the animal uh, that comes out on stage when uh, when the Tom Jones set is happening, and uh, you know, like uh, panties ever fly up? Ladies' undergarments no, ever fly on stage? No, 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 not yet, not yet. Lou and his accompanist Robert Clarot have been performing their new act at Ottawa's Villa Lucia for only three months. It was Robert who first talked Lou into doing the show. It just came to me. I said, you know, you look like Tom Jones. He said, look like Tom Jones? I said, he said, no, no way, no way. No, Lou wasn't crazy about the idea. At first? Yeah. I didn't know I did. Why? I don't know. Tom Jones, I didn't think, had that much following. Still not today, anyway. Not in 1990. I didn't think he still had a following, but that was obviously wrong. Still, performing Tom Jones is quite a departure for Lou. His musical background is rock and roll, first with the group Telemann, and later as lead singer with the popular Ottawa band, Rabbit. Anyway, I've played in front of uh, large crowds before, but when I did Tom Jones the first time, it was, uh, you know, I was kind of worried what, you know, what people would think, and uh, had a few friends in there too, and they were used to seeing me in a different context, so. When they saw me do Tom Jones, I thought I'd be like, uh, what's wrong with this guy anyway? All you gotta sing is, she's a lady. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, all right. There's all a right. part in the show where I, I usually get somebody up to come and sing to his wife, and uh, that's in probably one of the more popular songs, She's a Lady. And they really get into it. I mean, once they, I finally talked them into coming up on the stage uh, to sing to their wife or whatever. Then they get into the, the moving the hips and taking the shirts off, and uh, you know it's 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 pretty uh, pretty electric. Good job! How about a nice round of applause for Tom? Oh, I saw the light on the night that I passed by her window. Where can I go with this act? I'd like to eventually uh, take it to uh, to Vegas or uh, Atlantic City or something like that. You know, I mean, the potential is there, and obviously the the man's reputation is still intact. And I'd really like to do a good number on it. Maybe you could open for Tom Jones. Wouldn't that be something? <laughs> she laughed no more. I just couldn't take 